Hi everybody, I just voted. I know you can't, my, I know my sticker is backwards to you all, um, because it's a, the mirror effect, but it says I voted, even though y'all are gonna read it backwards. So hopefully you got an I voted sticker too, hopefully. So this is uh, the big day. This is November the 5th, 2024. This is, uh, this is a type of election where you vote like your life depended on it, because it does. And I am right outside my church. Well, I say my church. The church that I attend, I don't obviously have a claim on this church. Obviously, we, how many, we just say the church that I go to. I'm right outside Cerulean Baptist Church in Cerulean, Kentucky. And I'm very, 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 very thankful that our church allowed um, this to be a polling place. It was voted. Um, last fall that our church was going to be the new polling place for our local community and i'm very thankful for that i'm thankful that uh, as a body of christ uh, that our church is making this building available for voting i know some people think that you shouldn't mix politics and religion and people might have a problem with the fact that you vote at a church but i know that school buildings are opening up and uh, you can go vote at a school and there are many churches to vote at Quite frankly, I think it's a great thing that the church that I attend, the church that I have been a part of for so long, is a part of the community to open up where people can go vote. I'm very excited about it. So here's my wonderful um, ID. I showed my ID. I showed who I was. I'm a citizen, a natural born citizen of this country. I am very, very thankful to have had the opportunity to vote. Uh, I hope that you all also do that, uh, your due diligence. If you are um, eligible to vote, I hope that you exercise that right to vote. You need to treat this election like it's uh, the election that your life depends on because quite frankly, I think this is probably the most important presidential election we have had in decades. And yes, I do think that your life depends on voting today. And I certainly hope that you exercise that right. I'm very, very thankful, and you can see the beautiful fall trees behind me. It's a windy and blustery day, lots of activities. I was very happy to hear that um, there was a line at six o'clock this morning. I was told that there was a line at six o'clock this morning when the polls opened, and that's how important, and they said that these, these uh, poll taking people said that there has never ever been a line at six o'clock in the morning where people were lined up to vote. So it is a very important day in the life of our country. And I am just imploring and begging you to go vote, vote, vote. Uh, every vote matters, every vote counts. And again, I'm just thrilled that the church that I attend, Cerulean Baptist, I'm thrilled that we would have the opportunity to share our building and the community in which we live, to make that available to people to come vote, so please, I'm almost begging, maybe I should just get down on my knees, I'm almost begging that if you have the privilege of voting and you have the ability to vote, please use your responsibility, be responsible and go vote, make this happen, and let's see some very positive results um, for our country today. November the 5th, 2024, it's gonna be a day to be remembered in history. Y'all have a good one and go vote now.